Well, that was a play that we had talked about and we felt like was going to be there. And, and uh, it was just uh, a lot of it is, you know, is, uh, you know, them being in the right look at the right time. And fortunately, they were. And, and, uh, and uh, Jamoris made, uh, ran a great route, um, you know, set the guy up and, and made a great, great move to the post. And Eric actually was flushed a little bit and did a great job with his feet in the pocket and, and set his feet and threw a beautiful ball downfield. And, and you're right, that was a big play in the game. Yeah, great example of what uh, what I'm talking about. Uh, you know, defensively, you know, gave up a few plays. You got to give credit to them. You know, you got to give credit to them. They've uh, moved the ball on everybody they've played this year. Uh, yet, uh, when our defense, uh, you know, is uh, you know, has their backs against the wall, they find a way to make a play. Well, you know, we you hope to come out and uh, you know get it going right away in the second half, and and uh, you know if it doesn't happen, you know the thing you don't want to happen is your players panic. I thought we were, you know, getting a little bit frustrated, but uh, didn't get to that situation where it was working against us. And the wind was a little bit more of a factor than probably seemed like from the stands or from the from the press box. And you know we were glad that we had the wind in the fourth quarter. That made a difference too. Well, here's the deal is we've had a, you know, we have an outstanding conference. And so that prepared us for a lot of these types of games. Uh, we've actually been behind in most of the games we played this year. Uh, and again, our kids don't panic that, you know, I, I, you know, I told them at one point, let's be done building character now. We're fine. We're, we know we can come back. But, uh, you know, we've had all kinds of different games this year. We've had, we played in front of big crowds. We've had four TV games. We've had, you know, all those kinds of things. We've played with the lead. We've played from behind. We've had, you know, uh, game-winning drives, all those kinds of things that really, uh, you know, set you up for a playoff run like this. And our guys, besides all that, they know where they're going, they're, and they're confident they're going to get there. Well, he's, I tell you what, he really, he's a really a student of the game. He probably watches more film than any of our guys. And so he's, he prepares himself, and he's got a little knack for it. It's kind of like, fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, shame on you. And, and he seems to uh, take advantage of a, a team that will run the same play at him a couple times. Oh, what happened on that sideline? Like, uh, yeah. <laughs> that was on yours truly. That was uh, 18 years in the press box, and, and I still haven't figured out how to get out of the way. I, you know, I yell at the kids for being in the way all the time, and then I get a penalty. So it was kind of ironic. They, they laughed at me. Deservedly so. What's that? Oh, maybe. I'll, I'll take it if that if that's what it was. But uh, I'd like to give credit to them. I think they have kids that really fought till the end, obviously, and and they again they do an outstanding job coaching them. So I'd rather give credit to them. I mean, he's just a tremendous athlete. I'm. Just like he's talking about, he talked earlier about Douglas, how he's always in there in the film room. He's, he's another guy that's always in there studying, and he probably watches more film than I do. I mean, he just knows what he's doing out there, knows how to get open. And he's just a tremendous athlete. Come on, let's talk a little bit about that big touchdown that you guys had when it got cut to one point. Uh, Eric scrambled around and found you deep. Uh, that was a play we actually, it was open the first time we ran it, and Coach just came back to it. I created the old line and Eric for making the throw. I'm just out there trying to help him out and make plays. He's pretty fast too. They <laughs> did. I mean, uh, like Coach said, uh, even though it was a long road trip for us and something out of our element, we we came. We were ready to play today when we stepped off the you know off the bus and we were just ready to play. And they're, they're great athletes. I mean, everybody on the team can. Uh, team puts a uh, puts hard effort in each week at each day of practice and you know that's what happens in the game oh yeah it's it's lots of fun uh, you know I don't have to do too much running back there because I can just get the ball out to them pretty quick and they can do all the running for me so it's pretty fun
Yeah, they did. I mean, like Coach said, they got some great athletes on their team, and they came out and they played hard, and we knew they were going to. We knew they wouldn't give up, and we knew uh, we had to keep playing and keep playing, and we did that. Uh, yeah, that was huge. You know, my coach, I, I credit him for believing in me as well as Eric just for getting the ball to me. And it's up to me when my name is called just to go out there and make plays. Well, you talk about belief. I mean, when I brought up and think about the comeback, and I think this was in the playoffs against both of you guys that had been there. You had that huge final like, this is what we expect. This is what we expect. No big deal. Yeah, we expect that out of them to come out and give us their best effort. It's just up to us when the time, when the pressure comes. It's just us, up to us to just strive and just be better than them guys. Coach, you touched on it just a little bit. How do y'all, you talked about building character and community and doing that. How do y'all how do you build character? Uh, that's just something we do. Like Coach said, we've been playing from behind every single game. And kind of the playoffs, we've been jumping out on people. So we kind of used to being down. And when it happens, it's just we just find a way to win. Part of it is, you, you know, it's the playoffs. You expect that, right? I mean, you expect to to have great games and so you don't want you know even though there was a lead and so forth the, the, the thing you don't want is is to get frustrated because you know you want the kids to embrace it right you want you want them to say hey we're in the playoffs this is what it's all about let's love being in this situation instead of you know getting frustrated over it